Hi, in this video, I would like to cover how you can create the groups in BHOME. You can refer the knowledge article 00395007 and refer the BMC docs. Regarding the groups, each group is a logical collection of monitored entities in the BMC Helix Operations Management. The group's functionality allows you to filter and group impacted devices based on an entity selection criteria and events based on the events selection criteria. The groups can be associated to the authorization profiles if required. You can specify the groups as objects in the authorization profile, but this is totally optional step. So let's begin and start configuring the groups in the BHOME. Access the BMC Helix portal and launch the BMC Helix Operations Management. Now you are seeing the console. Click on the configuration and select the groups. At the right corner, there is a button called Create button. Once you click on the Create button, it will allow you to fill the group information. The step one is for the group information. You can specify the unique group name. For example, here I'm creating a group for the Windows servers. Specifying as a Windows hyphen server or group along with the required description. Please note, the group name is mandatory field name. So until you enter the group name, it will show the message in the red fonts. The field is invalid and this field is mandatory. So let's enter the group name. Step 2 is for the selection query. Create the selection query to group the entities, events or both. First option is entity selection criteria. For example, select the entities with the device name. Device name contains one closing the bracket and opening the bracket now i will select agent operating system contains windows closing the bracket the green checkbox shows the event entity selection criteria syntax is correct now you can preview to see the result as you can see, there are total 12 devices having 8 events which is matching with this criteria. I will now select the event selection criteria. Opening the bracket, I will choose severity, greater or equals, major, closing the bracket. Again, I will do the preview to see the result. Total, there are 12 devices having 3060 events. Step 3 is optional, so you can associate one or more authorization profiles from the available list. I will not choose this option at the moment, so I will now click on the save to save the group. Once the group is created, it will show the message on the console, the group is created successfully. Here you can see that the Windows hyphen server as a group name is created on today's date. To check the result, I will now click on the monitoring and select the groups. Here you can see that the Windows hyphen server group which is created recently, it is, it is listing in the, in the top three impacted groups. I will now click on the Windows hyphen server group to see the result. Here you can see that whatever the conditions that we have applied while creating the groups, the device name contains spoon and the agent operating system contains the windows. Regarding window events, it says severity greater than or equals major. Yeah. So as you can see that there are total 3060 events matching with the conditions. If once you click on the devices, yeah. 
So the entity device contains the phone and agent for operating system contains Windows. There are total 12 matching devices which are listing over here. This concludes my video. Thank you for watching.